Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to talk about the latest developments in the Ocean Cleanup's mission to clean up the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. 2019-2022 Operations In 2022, the Ocean Cleanup made eight trips into the GPGP and spent over 150 days at sea, including transit. During this time, 153,000 kilograms of plastic was removed from the patch, with 99.9% .9 of the catch consisting only of plastic. Introduction of System 002 In 2021, System 002 was introduced, and it has demonstrated the capability to consistently harvest significant amounts of plastic. The company is now in the process of transitioning to System 03 which is their largest and most efficient cleanup system yet. Transition to System 002-A and System 002-B In summer 2022, a new retention zone was installed to create System 002-A. Then, new wing sections with increased durability were added and the wing depth was increased from 3 to 4 meters due to underflow. This is referred to as System 002-B. Plans for System 002-C and System 03, in 2023, the wings will be extended to 1,600 meters to produce System 002-C, before further tests are conducted. The wings will then be further expanded to their full size of 2,500 meters, completing the transition and beginning operations for System 03. Celebration of the 100,000 kg milestone The 100,000 kg milestone reached was celebrated by Boyan Slat, the founder and CEO. The continuity of cleaning operations during the transition was essential in demonstrating the company's progress towards its efficiency targets and plan for scale-up. Winter break, System 002 has continued to perform well in the Pacific Ocean during 2022 and the initial signs from the transition to System 03 are positive. But, why does the company take a winter break if everything is going so well, during winter in the Pacific Ocean have an impact on the operation of System 002? The strong waves and dangerous storms increase sailing times and reduce the amount of plastic that can be caught, making the operation less efficient. The harsh weather also limits the implementation of the plastic hotspot computational modeling. Modifications and research during the winter break, during the time System 002 is offshore, modifications will be made and the efficiency of new components, such as new larger floating fenders, will be tested. The data gathered during operations will be studied to refine the strategy and ensure positive trends for 2022 continue. Commitment to a net positive impact on the marine environment, the ocean cleanup is committed to maximizing their net positive impact on the marine environment. They place particular importance on the 99.9% .9 of their total catch that consists of plastic, leaving a bycatch level of 0.1%. The environmental performance is a result of measures taken since the start of ocean operations. During the winter break, the company will be reviewing and improving their mitigation measures and procedures. The ocean cleanup has made progress in the GPGP this year and demonstrates impact and scalability in achieving their goal of ridding the oceans of plastic. The crew will work hard during the winter to optimize System 002 and prepare for a return to the open ocean in March 2023. And that's all for today's update on the ocean cleanup. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you again.